It's 647. Monday is all about your mental health. There's a saying about being kind to others because you never know what burden someone might be carrying, right? On this Mental Health Monday, Morning Reporter DJ Anthony is looking into depression and tells you what you should look out for in others, along with coping skills if it creeps into your life. But if the pawn reaches the other side of the board, then the pawn can be anything on the board. It could be the most powerful piece, which is a queen. Chuck Henderson, the Middle Georgia Regional Director of Chess and Community, says that same idea can even apply to kids. He works in the community to help children using the game of chess. You know, they're supposed to be kids having fun, but they're depressed due to outside influences, due to circumstances in life that's beyond their control. So with chess, that can give them a aosis. That can be a powerful coping tool if a kid is going through a stressful time. The CDC says about one in every six adults will have depression at some point in their life. So how can you tell if you're dealing with short-term stress or even sadness or something more serious? Some of the symptoms that some may feel is sadness, uh, loss of interest or wanting to do things, Licensed marriage and family therapist Wachovia Thornton says depression can look like not feeling like hanging out with friends or even enjoying normal hobbies. People can become more irritable and even have uncommon eating and sleeping habits. To help combat that, Thornton says getting a support system and surrounding yourself around positive people and influences can help. Have some type of insight. So when you know that like your body is changing or the way that you feel is changing. Henderson's message for kids works for others going through a tough stretch with time or maybe even outside help. Things will get better. It's about your progress, your journey and how you end. Thornton stresses that it's extremely important to know when to get outside help because depression can lead to suicidal thoughts or worse, they can turn into attempts. So it's important to get help from a therapist or your family doctor before you get to that point.